there's a cafe over there that does baked potatoes. <laughs> God, I could eat one of them. And do you know what? In the year, or oh, 18 months that I lived uh, back at my mum's, I bet I had a baked potato once. But now, being in Germany, where every other meal seems to be uh, some kind of sausage, quite fancy now. Oh, if I saw some cheesy beans on toast in the cafe now. This looks a cool place. I'm not exactly sure what it is. It looks like people are having drinks in there. I've got a feeling that that might be the place I'm looking for. Whole buildings covered in street art. Watch it not be open. Well, this is definitely the place that I wanted to come to for a drink, but I reckon that's the bar and it looks like it's closed. None of it's open, isn't it? I would go and have a look round, but my feet are killing. Oh, it's a bit dodgy, to be honest. So I've just been into the Adika, which is a small supermarket, um, which would have been pretty cool actually if uh, the hostel had actually got a kitchen, but it doesn't. So I looked around at all the things and didn't buy any of them apart from Meso Mix. Schmeckt not orange geiger or something. And I can work out it looks like it's a cola pushed orange. Which I presume means it's a cola and orange mix. Oh the street art, it's everywhere. Um weird thing about uh, German supermarkets is it's got all the price. But I think that the price on, that it shows you is not including tax because it's always more. So you get the right money out in change and then get there and it's wrong anyway. It does look like some 1970s uh, drink with the design. Maybe you should check the date on it. Alright, let's give it a go anyway. Alright, so here we go. My first time drinking Mezzo Mix. Nearly actually did it without taking the mask off. It's actually very nice. It's kind of cooler with the hint of orange. covered in graffiti and it stinks like piss but you're in a cool place well I'm now uh, happy and loaded on Bitburger so uh, it's time to uh, continue the walk I've still got miles to go it's, uh, it's about seven o'clock I think um, I'm not sure whether I'll, uh, well, I'm going to have to walk because I've lost my mask, so uh, it's just a pain, but um, anyway, I'm looking for some street art around here. had a bratburst all day 
so I, I definitely need to have some more food. Now, where I'm heading to now, I've got about three places saved um, on my Google Maps, places that I want to go and uh, that I wanted to go and eat at. Um, one of them is a big street food market. And the other is a chicken place. And I think there's uh, some like kind of local cafe which I think will close now anyway. Uh, so I may stop off on the way. Should eat there. Check that out. What did this place used to sell? Bloody hell. Berlin's just come back alive all of a sudden. When you go to Berlin, forget Potsdamer Platz and, and all that. It's just, it's just shit. It's like, you know, even the Sony Centre. Yeah, fair enough, it looked great. It's an amazing building. Um, it's basically the food court at Meadowall or any other shopping mall. You want the real Berlin, get out to the edges. Uh, you know, Newcomb and I don't even know where I am at the minute but I think it's uh, a lot of uh, kind of Turkish uh, restaurants and cafes and shisha bars and stuff like that what do you reckon this building is just looking at it I'd go for uh, swimming baths I was right 